If you have any ideas on alternative fuels to try for this series of videos, make sure to put it in the comments below. Thank you. Alright, so we're running two quarts of diesel fuel to one quart of gasoline. And as you can see, there's no smoke so far. We'll see what it has under a load. I do have it dialed in so that the choke is turned off. We're not using any choke. And it is idling, or it will idle. It's you know, a quarter throttle right now, roughly. But let's see what it does under a load. pretty good a uh, little bit more smoke than I wanted I'm gonna try adjusting the load jet on the carburetor and see if we can dial some of the smoke out of it cleared some smoke up. I turned it in about half a turn to three quarters of a turn. And um, the only thing I did notice is down at the end there's a little bit of the hill. When we went up that it started sputtering and coughing and hacking like it, like it leaned out. But it's kind of hard to tell what you're doing tuning it because you know normally you would think you know black smoke means it's running rich but you know with it being diesel fuel and it's a little bit less simple than that. I think it leaned out at the end when it it went to full governor to pull the hill and the bush hog. But uh, we're gonna I'm gonna turn it in a little bit more and see if it does it even worse. Then we'll know for sure. working so well I'm actually just gonna mow for a while I need to get this all mowed but this is actually pretty good honestly I think maybe 50 50 would maybe mix a little better or would run a little better but not a whole lot I don't I don't think anyway um, there's not too much smoke it's bearable and it seems to be I mean I put three quarts in it and you can see there's still quite a bit in there and I've been running for about 15 minutes now mowing and 
I don't know what the gas consumption would be if it was straight gas, but that seems pretty good to me compared to when we're burning the used motor oil, we could burn a quart in two minutes or a minute. So this seems to be a little more fuel efficient, but I could be wrong. I want to in the future do some videos on that, but do a little testing, but not today. Well, this push hog has a thing about heating shear bolts. I don't know if it's just not balanced right or what, but I was bush hogging along and all of a sudden I got no bush hog. And it looks like the bolt just vibrated. The, that's a lock nut, a swedge nut. And it apparently just vibrated itself right off there. Again. So I'm going to go see if I got a spare.